And just checking the time. I do see it is 10 o'clock. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. Um, we want to make sure we keep this brief and respect your guys' time this morning. So thanks for joining us. Um, my name is Danielle Ganji, and I am the Extension Educator in Sherburne County. We are so happy to have you with us. 4-H is all about learning by doing. So that's exactly what we're going to do this morning. We are going to move and learn about healthy living by being healthy and being active. Uh, Minnesota 4-H is brought to you by the University of Minnesota Extension. And we like to share with you um, research and information that can help you guys improve your daily lives. And being healthy is a great way to improve your life. So today, we, I'm going to talk about health. Health involves a lot of different things, right? Um, and it's one of the four H's on the clover. So today's healthy habit we're going to learn about is sleep. I know you guys just woke up. It's still the morning, right? But sleep is so important for your bodies. And getting enough rest each night is a great way to stay healthy. So hopefully you guys are alert and awake this morning so that we can learn about why it's important to get that sleep at night. There's four important healthy habits. And last time I was with you talking about health, we talked about eating healthy. And today we're going to talk about getting enough rest and sleep, but also having good hygiene, staying clean, important. Um, and I can't see it on my screen here, but the fourth one, uh, oh, and physical activity. And that's what Wiggle Wednesdays is all about. So we're going to do both today, learning about sleep and getting our body moving. All right, here. Click over. So we need sleep. It's super important to keep us healthy, happy, and doing our best and keeping our body healthy. So anybody know how many hours of sleep should you get at night? Especially for kids that are 5 to 12 in that age range. Anyone know? You can unmute yourself and say it if you know. 12 hours. Ooh, that's close. 15. Ooh, that's a lot. Sometimes I wish I could get that much. 10 hours. That would be the whole day. All right, let's see what the answer is. 10. So, 5 to 12, 6 to 8 especially should get 10 hours of sleep at night. I heard somebody say it there at the end, so good job. Yes, 10 hours of sleep at night. So that means going to bed on time and waking up at a reasonable time and not sleeping the whole day away either. All right? So not only is it healthy to keep our for our bodies, but also our brain too, so you can remember things. Your mind can stay alert. You can pay attention and help solve problems and new ideas, which is great. And it helps your muscles, your bones, and your skin, and your body to grow, which is important when you're a kid, and can help heal injuries and keep your body healthy and fight um, sickness, too. That's why when you're sick, rest is, like, the most important thing. All right. Now, I'm going to share some tips with you, and this is where you're going to move, okay? If you think that this thing would help you sleep, lay down on the ground and pretend you're sleeping. If you think that this thing would maybe keep you awake and not keep you sleeping or not help you go to sleep, stand alert and awake Hi, and Kayla. up. All right? So here's going to be some of the tips, okay? If you have a nice, cool bedroom, do you think that would help you sleep or stay awake? Sleep. Sleep. Yep. Oh, lay down. All right. If your bedroom is hot and bright. No. No. Yeah, that would keep me up. Yep. All right. If you drink a lot of sugary drinks at night. No. No. Yep. Stand up. No. All right. If you have a bedtime routine and do the same thing every night. Yes. Yep. Stay down. 
All right. If you eat a huge snack or meal right before bed. No. Yep. Try not to do that before bed because that could keep you awake. If you are running around and doing so much exercise during the day. Yes. Yep. Keeping yeah. your body moving and exercising is a great way to be tired and get sleep at night. All right. Having a regular bedtime. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yep. Your body likes routine and schedule. So going to bed at about the same time every night is really good for you. All right. Listening to relaxing music. That helps me. Sometimes even having white noise or something if you're distracted can help. All right, good job. Next. Now, I love singing like camp songs and songs that have actions and are a little bit silly. So that's what we're gonna do next. And they actually have to do with sleep, all right? So what I'm gonna do is we're gonna sing a couple songs. We'll see how much time we have. We might even be able to get three in here. But they do have actions. So try to follow along with me. I'm going to stop sharing my screen so you guys can see me. And we're going to, the first one is about having enough energy when we wake up in the morning. All right, let me just stop. All right. It's like, there we go. Okay, so everybody stand up. Make sure you have a little room to move around. This first one is called the birdie song. And it's something that I like to do to help wake people up in the morning. Sometimes I sing it to my kids if they're having some trouble getting going. But follow along with me. And we might even do it two times so you can follow along with me the next time. All right, ready? Way up in the sky, the little birds fly. Way down in the nest, the little birds rest. With a wing on the left and a wing on the right, the little birds slumber all through the night. Shh, the birds are sleeping. The bright sun comes up, the dew goes away. Good morning, good morning, the little birds say. All right, now, Let's do it one more time, and let's see if you can follow along and do some of the words with me, okay? Do stay muted, but be free to sing as loud as you want in your houses, okay? All right. Way up in the sky, the little birds fly. Way down in the nest, the little birds rest. With a wing on the left and a wing on the right, the little birds slumber all through the night. Shh, the birds are sleeping. The bright sun comes up, the dew goes away. Good morning, good morning, the little birds say. Good job. All right, the next one is also about being alive and alert and awake and enthusiastic because we need that and we, the only way we can get that is by getting enough rest and sleep at night. So, this one is just like head and shoulder, knees and toes. So you guys should already know the actions to this one, but it has a little different words, okay? All right, it's called alive, alert, awake, and enthusiastic, all right? So we do the motions for head, shoulders, knees and toes, but use different words, all right? I'm a live alert, awake, enthusiastic. I'm a live alert, awake, enthusiastic. I'm a live alert, awake. I'm awake, alert, alive. I'm a live alert, awake, enthusiastic. All right. I think you could do it a little faster. All right, let's try it. All right. I'm a live alert, awake, enthusiastic. I'm a live awake, alert, enthusiastic. I'm alert, alert. Alert, awake, alive. I'm awake, alive, alert. I'm alert, awake, alive, enthusiastic. Whew. It gets confusing <laughs> when you're saying a lot of similar words sometimes. 
All right, we're gonna do it one more time, even faster, and maybe I can even get the words right this time. <laughs> All right, I'm a live alert awake enthusiastic. I'm a live alert awake enthusiastic. I'm a live alert awake. I'm alert awake alive. I'm a live awake alert enthusiastic. I didn't get the actions right, but at least I got the words. <laughs> All right, let's see, how are we doing for time? Ooh, I think we have enough time for a pretty silly song. And I'm not going to do the whole thing because it gets a little long. But um, this is about pajamas, and it's super silly. And when you go to bed at night, it's nice to wear super comfy clothes so you can roll and wiggle around and be nice and cozy in your bed, right? So this song is sung to the tune of the Battle Hymn of the Republic, if you know it. Some of the grown-ups might know that song. And it's called Pink pajamas all right and maybe we'll be able to do the first first two times um, and it does have some actions so just kind of follow along with the actions with me if you can all right deep breath ready I wear my pink pajamas in the summer when it's hot and I wear my flannel nighties in the winter when it's not and sometimes in the springtime and sometimes in the fall i jump in in the sheets with nothing on at all glory glory hallelujah glory glory what's it to ya sometimes in the springtime and sometimes in the fall i jump between the sheets with nothing on at all all right ready let's do it one more time and if you remember some of the words this time you guys can sing it with me, okay? All right. I wear my pink pajamas in the summer when it's hot. And I wear my flannel nighties in the winter when it's not. And sometimes in the springtime and sometimes in the fall, I jump between the sheets with nothing on at all. Glory, glory, hallelujah. Glory, glory, what's it to ya? Sometimes in the springtime, Sometimes in the fall, I jump between the sheets with nothing on at all. All right, that's a silly one, and it even has some more verses. So if you think it's kind of funny, you can go look it up. Um, one place to look up some fun camp songs like this is Ultimate Camp Resource. So that's a website that you can go to look for some of these songs if you like them. All right, how are you guys doing? You know, I'm a little out of breath because it's hard to sing and do actions at the same time sometimes. All right. That about sums up our time together this morning. It's almost 1015. So I know we're done a little early, but I hope that you guys learned about why it's super important to get good sleep at night so we can be active and wiggle, right? So maybe learn some of those tips in a ways to get your bedroom and yourself ready for bed at night and have your rooms be nice and cozy for sleeping. Thank you all for joining us this morning and we hope to see you again next Wednesday, I think, for um, another session of Wiggle Wednesdays. Stay tuned!